Your Excellency, my dear brother, the President of the Senate, the Honorable Speaker of the State House of Assembly, Honorable Members of the House of Representatives here present, the Honorable Minister of Aviation, my dear brother, Senator Hadi Srika, Honorable Members of the OBC House of Assembly, Honorable Commissioners, Special Advisors and Liaison Officers, the Security Officers, the State Chairman APC, the Secretary to the State Government, the Head of Service, the Chief of Staff, Senior Government Functionaries here present, the Chairman, Karaswa Local Government Council and other Council Chairmen here present, Your Royal Highnesses, our, our leaders, gentlemen of the press, ladies and gentlemen, Assalamu Alaikum. I am glad to be here at this historic occasion of the groundbreaking ceremony for the construction of the Wachakal Air Strip recently approved by the federal government. The need for efficient and effective means of transport to accelerate growth and development of a society, state or nation cannot be overemphasized. Therefore, the commencement of this project which we are here to launch today signifies the importance and commitment of the federal government to execute project and put it to use for the benefit of our people. This airstrip, when completed, will ease transportation of goods and services into and out of the state, thereby increasing the volume of trade, creating employment opportunities, and improving the economy of the people. There are huge potentials and opportunities in this project to our farmers, the business community and the people generally. The airstrip will no doubt boost agricultural production and trade in the agricultural products, especially rice, millet, sesame seeds and livestock as local and international merchants may use the airstrip. Let me use this opportunity to specially appreciate His Excellency President Muhammad Buhari GCFR for the generous approval of this airstrip. This is indeed another dividend of democracy extended to the good people of Yobe State. It is an undeniable fact that Yobe State has enjoyed federal presence and intervention under the under Buhari administration more than any other regime since the return of democracy in 1999. Early this year, the Federal Executive Council also approved 8 billion for the Damaturu Regional Water Project. Work has commenced as, in pro as, in, as is in progress. When completed, the project will adequately address the water needs of Damaturu and other communities neighboring the state capital. Similarly, the federal government approved the Fika Gadaka water transfer project, which started in 2003 but was abandoned in 2007. These interventions will complement our efforts in meeting the water needs of our people. The state is also benefiting from the Potako to Meiduguri rail line with an extension via Damaturu to Gashua, cutting across many towns. This will open up many towns and communities with increased business and social activities. The state has enjoyed many more projects which before now were denied. Let me seize this opportunity to also appreciate His Excellency, the President of the Senate, Senator Ahmed Ibrahim Lawan, a worthy ambassador of the state, a true representative of the people, a very patriotic Yobian, 
for providing purposeful and quality leadership to the National Assembly. The National Assembly, under your leadership, has provided the needed support and cooperation to, the pres to President Mohamed Buhari administration to execute government policies and programs with ease. You have attracted federal projects to the state and supported the state government in its quest to get its dues and shares from the federal government, thereby complementing the efforts of the state government to move the state forward. I'm glad to inform this gathering that construction work on the own Yobis International Cargo Airport in Damatru has been completed. We have procured and installed the required equipment. Similarly, firefighting machines have been supplied. We are currently working on the Damatru Bayamari Federal Highway linking the airport. As you are aware, we have test run activities on the runway while the equipment installed have also been tested. By the grace of God, we are getting so that we can have an airport that will stand the test of time for the state to have value for its money. I thank you so much and look forward to a more increased synergy as we, go, as we get closer to commissioning the airport for the benefit of the state and the people. Thank you all. She Amini Mu Minister De Gabata de Jawabin Sa Yai Manatambaya Anang Yate Shugaba Mahamud Buhari Al Heri Ne Jamaa Saka Ansa de Chewa Al Heri Ne To Al Heri Anang Kuote Woman Nang the Zamanda Muke Anang Ya tabbatar mu mu gaya wa kan mu gaskiya cewa shugaba Muhammad Buhari alheri ne Yanzu ko baya kadan shekaru biyu uku da suka shige mun yi samu taro haka ba tare da an tattance wasu ko an shiga layi an tattaba jikin mutane kuma ba tare da ana wai wayen baya ana kallo ko bom zai tashi a nan ko can mun isa mu taro a nan to tambaya ana akwai abin da yake zaman lafiya akwai abin da yake zaman lafiya to yaushe rabuwan ku da barin damatru da gudu yaushe rabuwan ku da gudu ku bar cikin garin gashuwa yaushe rabuwan ku da zama dardar a cikin garin guru mun yi addu'a Allah ya ba mu shugaban kasa da zai cire mu a wancan halin ko ba mu yi ba Allah ya amsa ko bai amsa ba rokon Allah bokanci ne rokon Allah yana karewa to Allah ya amshi addu'a mu kuma yana kan addu'a mu shi yasa shugaban kasa Muhammadu Buhari yake nan kan karagan mulki lafiya kuma yana gudanar da mulki lafiya saboda haka dukkan abin da shugaban kasa Muhammad Buhari yake ba yake kawowa saboda ci gaban Najeriya da ci gaban jihar mu musamman mana yobe yana bayan zaman lafiya da ya samar mana 